There are tons of Android emulators out there, but if you're stuck with a low-end PC, most of them just don't run well. In this video I've handpicked three of the best emulators specifically designed for low-end PCs. I'll walk you through their strengths, limitations and exactly on what kind of PC they work best. And yes, I'll also show you an emulator that runs smoothly even on just 1GB of RAM with no graphics card. Stick around till the end to find the one that fits your PC best. Before we start, like the video subscribe to the channel and let's get started. LD Player 9 is one of the best balanced emulators for weak or mid-tier systems. What makes it unique is that it relies on your CPU more than GPU, so even if you don't have a graphics card it still works smoothly. It runs on Android 9 which supports almost every app and game you'd want to use. With just 4-8GB RAM and a decent dual-core CPU, LD Player 9 gives a surprisingly smooth experience. It also includes features like multi-instance, key mapping and game optimization. If you're looking for a reliable daily driver that doesn't overwhelm your system, LD Player 9 should be your first choice. Nox Player Classic is another excellent emulator that runs well even on older PCs with 2GB to 4GB of RAM. It gives you a very customizable interface with features like screen recording, key mapping and even gamepad compatibility. Nox Player doesn't demand a GPU and works well even on integrated graphics. Smart Gaga is a hidden gem for low-end gaming. It's specifically optimized for lighter games like Free Fire, Clash of Clans, and even some older FPS games. What sets it apart is that it doesn't require virtualization and performs well even on systems with 2GB RAM and no GPU. Keep in mind that Smart Gaga is mainly for games. If you're looking for app usage or newer Android versions, this might not be your top pick. But for smooth gaming on a basic PC, it's a fantastic choice. Mumu Nebula is the lightest emulator in this list and was designed specifically for ultra-low-end PCs. Even if your system has just 1GB of RAM, no GPU and virtualization turned off, Mumu Nebula can still run. The downside is it runs on Android 7, which means some newer apps may not work. But if you just want to run lighter apps or classic Android games, this is your best bet. And that wraps up our list of the top 4 Android emulators for low-end PCs in 2025. If you found this video helpful then give it a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel.